Hello guys, I'm Joshua8600, and welcome to me trying another new game. This time, this is Super Mash. From what I understand from the eShop, when, um, when I, I, because the eShop description is so great, I didn't want to read it this time, because, like, the, the concept is simple to me. It's not like the other things where I showed it, which was, like, pretty confusing, at least to try to explain it. This is, like, basically takes two different game genres, like platforming and stealth, merges them together, or RPG and apparently space shooters shoot mash them together i don't know how that works so yeah this looks really cool so yeah never played this before um i don't think i should okay i'll i'll start the timer when i press a that's like a perfect time is there any music yet yes but it's really quiet even on my tv Huh. It should be fine though. Maybe it's just my. Th okay. And th and three, two, one. Let's pickle. Oh okay, I did press A. Just take a little bit. Hey, Super Mash is a game that makes games. However, because it's a system, Super Mash doesn't design games the way a person would. The matches can be good, bad, or good, weird, unbalanced, incredibly hard, super easy. We like this. We're complete randomization, procedural generation stuff. We like this. The fun comes from finding and saving the games and rising to the challenge to overcome seemingly unbeatable mashes. Embrace the chaos and let the games decide. This, see, this, this is exactly like what I like already. This is great. New game. Okay, let's look at options. By the way, apparently according to the eShop, there's like free DLC updates. They're not actually listed DLC, but the, they, when they update the game, you'll get more features. Not sure like how true that is or like how old this is. But like that, at least that's in the eShop description. Um, know what? Let's restart the timer um, because we didn't start a game yet, right? In three, two, one. Let's pickle. All right. Funtron. You can skip it with B. Don't want to do that. Why does he look so sad? This is supposed to be a ha okay. It's supposed to be a happy game. Testing. Is this thing on? Now that's loud. The whole thing started a few months ago. Hey. It was a typical Saturday morning with my sis, looking for games at a local garage sale. Okay. As we were about to leave, I spotted this kid begging his parents for a busted-up original G player. I heard them tell him it wasn't in the budget. A spoiled kid would have thrown a fit, but I watched him quietly Aww. walk away. Something inside said to give him my G player axe. The kid looked at me like it was Christmas or something. The owner of the house was watching me, and she handed over a giant box of play type carts and some hardware. It looked like a bunch of amazing junk at the time. I, I'm just listening the to the story right now. Don't by. have a lot to say. He just sold the building, and we had one month to get out. Jume was devastated. Jume. She spent the last four years of her life building up the shop. And in the span of a few minutes, all seem to be slipping away. So they have a month to get their Honestly, shop out. Completely unrelated. This this box, main character that's speaking. All about it. He reminds me a lot of the character the design of Percy Jackson. Our lives forever. At least with that hair this? shape, I don't know. Well, we've gotten ourselves into something deep. And this is what the hero always does in the movies. Let me tell you about the mash machine. The mash machine. Okay. Oh wait, so is this actually like a story thing too? It works, what did you do? I just got a message. Okay. It works, what did you do? Uh, just put in the cards. Hold on, give me a moment, sorry. Alright, uh, just put in the cards. But we tried that earlier, it didn't work. You put in both? Um, no, only one. Why would you put two carts in at the same time? Okay, I don't know, but this is pretty fun. Zany, but fun. Sorry, I'm like distracted on the phone. Okay! That's a looks like Metroidvania is a genre on its own. Look at the back of the carts. They all have a genre label and a bunch of numbers. Hello, whoever just joined. Josue! 
just in time. Remember the super mash that I uh, on that I got during your break earlier? I the, we're about we literally just started three minutes ago, so we haven't even mashed a game yet. This is gonna be really cool, I think. What genre should we slot in? Okay, so let's look through them. Metroidvania, action adventure, platformer. We like that. It's my favorite genre. Stealth. Kind of like my least favorite genre of games, really. Shoot 'em up, JRPG. Oh, that's it for now. Maybe there's gonna be more unlockable. I don't know. Let's right, right now. Let's just choose platformer, and I can. Well, I can do two platformers if I wanted to. That's interesting. Um, Hosway, you choose. What's the next one I do? Do no. Just tell me what genre to match. That's it. Of these that are here. JRPG? Okay, let's do it. Let's go. JRPG's a uh, Japanese uh, role-playing game. You know, like uh, turn-based Final Fantasy, stuff like that. Play-type game machine. Okay, is it going to load? Maybe it's like generating the game right now. Maybe that's maybe it takes a few seconds. I don't know. Maybe it crashed. Because bu buttons aren't doing anything. Okay, there we go. Whoa, V11. Copyright 1990, Funtron, Funtron, all rights reserved, push, push, I can't speak, A to start. Loading, has to load a cartridge. Okay, there we go. There's, there's a story! To grow big and strong, remember to always eat the strange moving mushrooms from the questionable squares. That's what my grandmother always said to me growing up. Not sure what she was talking about. Everyone knows you have to eat the hearts that fall from the sky to do that. <laughs> I'm already confused. But she was a princess from a different castle. <laughs> Mario 1 reference right there. Oh, But our princess is in another castle. Oh my god. Maybe they eat differently there. <laughs> I'm already having a blast and we're only five minutes in. Del Kairos. Health. Two. Speed. Three. Oh, that's pretty good. Weapon. Golden Knife. That sounds good. Special abilities. Blade. Sheila. Dash. Dodge roll. Okay, so dash is Y. Down Y is dodge roll. Double jump is double A. Okay. So, by the way, when I first started the game, it said that any the games could either be weird, uh, good, incredibly hard, super easy. It's completely random. So if thing is, so if it ends badly, then that just shows you know potentially good or bad randomization. Okay. Okay. There's a potion of sorts. Oh! This activates the battle. I have a party member. Oh, Blade and Sheila. Those aren't my abilities. Those are my party members. Oh, that makes more sense. Okay, because I was like, Sheila, is that supposed to be shield? Okay, um, so Blade is gonna... T I don't know what any of this means. Let's just attack him. Oh, Blade is strong. How he uses dismantling squeeze. Sheila, attack that thing. It didn't die. Candle uses whack bomb. And we're all asleep. Oh, great. Turn skipped. Overpower. Oh, oh, I'm almost dead. Spell, regen, item. Uh, I have a potion. I, I have four small potions. You know what? I'm going to use a potion to make sure I just stay alive. Oh, okay, yeah. Blade seems to be strong. Why are they only attacking my main character? Okay, I, wait. I can do golden knife or a head jump. I don't know if they're like status effects like burns because that thing seems to be on fire. So we're just going to go with the knife for now. It's still not dead. Even the even Blade couldn't kill it. All heal 20. Okay, that didn't do much, but it's some healing, I guess. Blade, kill it. Thank you, Blade. Okay, you found 69 coins, of course. We found a nice number of coins. Have to throw that in there. Okay, so I have a double jump. So, wait, I only have eight minutes to beat the stage. Or is that or to beat, or is that the whole mash? 
Oh, uh, so here's another battle. Okay. We're gonna attack the bottom thing first. Cause hope oh. Oh no, I'm gonna die. Spell. It's just this thing. Okay. Dang it, Del Kairos is already maybe that's not like maybe I'll still survive if like my character one of my party members stays alive, but that doesn't look like it's gonna happen already. Okay, let's use a potion on Blake. Can I use a potion on him to revive him? No, I can't. Oh, well, looks like I'm dead. Oh, now I'm asleep. Beautiful. Am I gonna die? Yep. <laughs> okay, we lost. <laughs> hey, it's a it's a completely random. It could be incredibly hard. It could be super easy. We don't know. Okay, I lost all my health. I could f I could retry. What are dev cards? All non full dev cards will be destroyed on use. I don't know what that means. Share. Mash shared. Your share code is this. If someone wants to play this mash, if I upload this video to YouTube. Here, here's the here's the mash code, people. If you want to play this one, I'm taking a screenshot of it too. But we're we're gonna make a new mash. Is we we go all in, all our chips in. If we then if if we die, then we're dead. We have to start something new. That's just how these runs work. Oh wait, I can, what is this part of the game? I am moving so slowly. Ew. Let's just do a mash. I want to play game. Wait a second. Um, I hit quick mash. Does that mean it did one on like completely random? And I didn't even choose the genres. It did. Okay, this one's copyright 1988. Hey, press army fire. Press A to start. What was that sound? Mysterious figure 93.5. All right, recruit. You'll need to find the blue key card in under ten minutes in order to continue to the next stage. M so we're mercenary mongoose. Seems like a strange mission for a secret agent. Kid, I've been a spy for thirty years. Find the blue key card in under ten minutes is one of the most vital missions you will ever have. Of course it is. I see. Well, I guess I better get started then. With a name like mercenary mongoose. You want to stay out of the limelight as much as you can. You better end calm. Hey. This is weird. Hey, so is this another JRPG? Three health, two speed. Look at that sprite. That looks terrible. Blue laser is our weapon. Is that it? Active glitch. Random enemy die. Act. What? So is this a beat em up? Oh, hey, look! We're Snake! We could put a box on us. His down taunt. Because I don't know anything else about... I don't know anything Metal Gear, so that's just his... Uh... I'm not sure how, but you're killing random enemies on the screen. Who's Rob? I guess that happened... Oh, Tomo. That's, so that's our main character. My guess is that it happened because I didn't attack for a few seconds. Yeah, okay. It's a glitch. Random enemy die. Because, you know, we're mashing two games together. Glitches are bound to happen, right? <laughs> so remember, things can be incredibly easy. This just might be an incredibly easy mash. So, pressing L is our inventory. And the timer stops when we're in the inventory. Secondary item. Let's see. Do I have any other buttons? Controls, maybe. Platformer. Metroidvania. No, this is just for everything. I have no idea what this is. Really, so whatever. Let's just resume. Alright. 
Vine just waiting for the glitch to uh, kill that thing. Hmm. Maybe. Oh, I guess the camera isn't an enemy. I found the. Is that the blue key card already down there? I know that was what I was thinking of the when the light is on us. You found the blue key card. Prime journal item added. Mash complete. Collect rewards. Captain Knives. Only a true warrior sports a scar as a Brandoiler. Brandolier. Bandolier. I don't know what that means. But it's an enemy. Tokens times five. Let's share it. Every time I do a match, I guess I'll just get the code on the screen. Because why not, right? There's a match code. So, A, return. Huh. Weird. Okay. This overworld thing looks really bad. Okay. Rob, what's your favorite energy drink? I don't think any JRPG will ever top Ultimate Fantasy 7. It's not like Final Fantasy 7, right? Completely different. Okay. Jumei, what, do you, what will you say to me? Seeing it, nothing to it. If only you had that confidence during the last Ultimate Fighter DX tournament. Uh, low blow, Jumei. I'm just kidding, Pipsqueak. Anyway, can I try another one? Yeah, I'm curious to see how much variety is possible. You and Tomo can rotate. Let me know after you've been a few of these. Um, what should we call them? Hybrid genre blends. That sounds horrible. Uh, what about mashes? I like it. L Luddites. Luddite. I don't know. If that's Is that an insult like to them? Is that like a reference to something? Hey. So, Jumei. Did Mom and Dad are on vacation again. So, wait, that's his sister, right? Jumei? Jumei's his sister. Credits. Yeah, we don't really care about those. Mash code. That's where. So, that's where you can enter the mashes. Who's uh, who's this kid? Don't steal from my shop. I've been wanting to play a hard platformer game. Maybe something short? Sure. Do you have the hard platform game yet? The short one? I'm on it. I don't, well, okay, how do I uh, make one that's short? Oh, the, there's glare in the camera now. That's just going to happen from the sun, I guess. That's actually, that, no, let me turn that off temporarily. Let me just, there we go. Just for now. To, so we can get rid of that glare. Oh, there's a lot of people here. Holy moly. Oh, I guess those are just people outside. So, Prime Master, what is that? Dev cards. Okay, what does this mean? Top de Action Adventure. Platformer. I don't know what any of this is. Maybe, like, these are, like, un unlockable things. Stealth. Okay, so we found the blue card in the stealth missions, I guess. So, I guess these are, like... Unlockables or something. Dev cards. Okay. Del Kairos. Lady. I don't want any of this means. Guess we'll figure it out. Um, what's this right here? Saved mashes. Yeah, we don't have any of those. And then obviously, this is the mash machine over here. Buy card packs. Hold on. Each pack contains three normal cards and one foil. I need 100 coins. I only have 11. I don't really think I can buy any of those right now. All right. Create mash. By the way, is that... Was it... Hold on. That that looked like Zelda on the screen for a second. All right. Let's choose shoot him up. And... Action adventure. <laughs> it 
It's exciting! Let's see if the glare is gone yet. Nope, it's even worse actually. A55, Thunder Killer and Tail. Okay. That definitely looked like Link in the bottom right. Okay. Loading. Okay. As records show, the Scythe had known of our world in this in this corner of the cosmos for quite a while, only taking action when they discovered Electeros on the planet, a powerful but rare fuel source. Although their main forces were busy in other battles, they still sent infiltrators to gather intelligence who prepped for the planned conquest of our world about 200 years, as well as maintained a destabilizing presence on the planet. I'm already lost. One such agent was Zelnak. Although he ultimately set the humanity's mission to eliminate high value 855 Thunder Killer targets in under seven minutes, was one of many planned to heighten the already boiling tensions between free nations and the Grand Reign. Ty. Health, three. Speed, three. Okay, Ty sounds pretty good so far. Weapon, slow rang. Special abilities, Z10 missile on B. It's active glitch. Perm attack buff and no second glitch. Eliminate how about... Okay. Oh. Oh, cool. My slow rank sucks. Look at that. Okay, I guess right now we're just supposed to- I guess right now it's actually a bullet heck and we're just dodging rather than shooting. Ouch. I'm already almost dead. Ty! Oh, that missed. I already don't have any of those left. My rockets. Oh, yes, I do. I just collected two of them. So, yeah. And I missed. What is that, like, butterfly thing? Is that, like, a, a mini shield? Is that the boss? One out of 15. Is this even possible with five more minutes left? Ouch. Um, yeah, Ty is about to die. Because his slow rank can't do anything. Two out of 15. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, wait, no, I collected extra lives. That's what those fairies were. They're like, I guess they're like bottled fairies from Zelda. Oh, now I'm dead, though. Or did I? So I'm curious what this means for me now. Give me my thing, blue thingy. Okay, I want that too. This is money. I don't know what money does. But we live in a capitalist society, so money is always good, right? Okay, Ty's dying hard. Ooh. Okay, I, th I just slowed down the timer a little bit, I think. Okay, I'm not, I, all I'm saying is I'm not a fan of this mash. 
mean, if I had an actual, an actual gun thing to shoot, that would be nice. And then my slow rank, it's hard to aim it too. Ah! Oh my goodness. Like it moves where your cursor is at the at that moment. I found a bow. I found a rocks. How do I use the bow? Oh, I'm dead. I found oh, I found another slow ring. That's exactly what I needed in my life. But like because the the slow rank goes wherever uh, my in how do, okay my inventory is full how do I switch items? Oh, I can shoot! I want that help. I mean, it's not great, but it's something. Oh my god. Fairy. Oh no, that wasn't me dying. That was the uh, like a lap. Finishing a lap in the game. And my inventory is full. Okay. Why does he keep saying that? If only Ty would move a little bit faster. Money! We're, see, we've only killed four of these things, and we have to kill 11 more in two minutes. I don't know how that's... I don't know if that's possible. Because this is an auto-scroller. I can't just go faster. Unless if you kill the things on the screen faster, then maybe the next wave of enemies comes faster. Like, potentially. Five out of fifteen. We have a fairy. Okay. I have no idea. Oh, what is that thing? Is that an I okay, a consumable health potion. I guess we did mix this with action adventures, so I guess that's why there's like a bow and rocks. So. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's grab the bomb! Hey, 6 out of 15. We have 30 seconds left. Do you think we can kill nine more in 30 seconds, Josue? I don't, I don't think I can, just saying. At least I've collected 616 monies. Ten. Nine, eight, with the monies, three, all the marbles. Game over. You ran out of time. Let's share it. Okay, so that's the code for this one. I don't quite understand how we, like, if that one was even possible. Might not have been. Okay, the glare's gone. For the most part. Now I look, now I just look like the, now I'm just like, Per, like the gate, the, sh the lights from sh up above are shining down on me. 
That's what it looks like now. That's all. Quest ZR. This button. Hard short platformer game. Win three mashes. I won one mash, didn't I? I still only have 11 coins, so maybe that doesn't actually do anything. Hmm. So just a hard but short platformer game. So should I just mix two platformers together? Oh wait, I oh I can change it to be short and the difficulty to be hard. Okay, let's try that. Twisty smile. I hope there's no story to this one. Loading. Loading. Loading! Okay, there's a story. The way that monster still s is smiling at you makes it look hungry. But is jumping on it so you can collect the three gold coins in under ten minutes in safety still an okay thing to do? The three gold coins in under ten minutes. Hopefully wherever it goes afterwards has lots of tasty things to eat. That must... Things that conveniently aren't you. Okay, so... Three golden coins in ten minutes. So there seems to be a theme here. Digi-wing. Oh, great. No health, no speed, but I do have head bounce. It's my weapon. Dodge roll and double jump. Okay. Tiny enemies, players slow down. So that means I'm even freaking slower. How did I die? Oh, is it? It's an auto scroller too. What's a head? Then how do I use the head bounce? Ouch! Fast retry. What's the difference between fast retry and a regular retry? One is fast! I don't know what that means, game! Yeah. Okay. Glitch. Tiny enemies. They don't look very tiny. Ouch! Oh my god. I suck. Dang it. All right, let's retry. Let's see, let's see what that does. Maybe it makes a new game. I don't know. <sighs> Twisty smile. Or maybe that just starts... Maybe it would just like go past the story. Maybe that's the only difference. B to skip. Collect the three gold coins. I didn't even see one gold coin.
There's a letter up there. Oh, that one I can jump on. What's the rules about jumping on enemies? Oh my god. So that one I guess I can't just jump on. But notice every time I double jump, that makes them smaller. Dang it! Ah! I don't think I can beat this one. I can't even get past like the first 20 seconds. And you have to do this all in one life for their checkpoints? Or their continues? Alright, let's try it one more time, then I guess we'll, maybe we'll create a new mash. Oh my goodness. I don't know what to do. I'm so bad at video games. Right. So yeah, basically, I'm double jumping rapidly to make them smaller. So I guess. So I guess they, uh, so like, they won't be that big of a health r risk. Oh my, okay. What do I do there? My match score is 37. Like, I have to get lower just so I can see if there are any of the golden coins. There, oh, that's one. Dang it. There's no way. Okay. We're going to try a new mash. We're going to try a new mash. Oh, I didn't share it. Oh, my God. My bad. So is that one lost to eternity? I guess so. So. Quest. Hard short plot. I mean, didn't I do that then? Or maybe I had to like save it. Kid. I don't understand. Okay, let's try that again. Change the settings with Y. We want short and hard. Start match. Okay. Play type game machine. Princess animal mascot. Okay. Thanks for the seven months of tier one subscription, Penguin. I really appreciate it. Seven months of great content. Keep up the good work. Thank you for the sub and the support. I really appreciate it. 
From the strange squares of the Kuba Kingdom to the snowy fields of slippy icy snowland, there is a world of something. I missed it. While well, everything can be jumped on, beware the wacky and mixed up enemies. They'll often throw an arrow or a rocket your way. Do you have what it takes to jump, roll, and bop your way to retrieve the invention for DD in under 10 minutes? Or will you end up falling down a bottomless pit? Let's find out. Ooh. Let's see. Okay, Scout. One health, one speed. He has a head bounce weapon. That's probably just jumping. Yeah, and I can wall jump and high jump. Random enemy die. Player slow down. And enemy damage. Wait, is this random what it is? Hello, whoever just joined. Who is, who is that? Oh, hey, Aqua. You sounded different. Retrieve them. So I just, okay, so I have a regular jump, then just pressing A is a high jump, but it's not a, a double jump. Okay. Glitch. Player slow down. No, this is a game called Super Mash. Whatever you did, whatever you just did is slowing you down. So weird. Looks like it's happening after a bit of time passes. Yeah, it's called a glitch! From mixing two random games together, you ninnies. Ah, the enemies are doing more damage. Definitely happened when that enemy took damage. It's no, I just no, I had to mash two platformers together. But earlier, I was playing a mix between an action adventure and a uh, oh, cool, now I'm slowed down and a shooter. And then I also did an, a JRPG mixed with a platformer. And I died on that one. You can, you can, no, no, this is a game where you mix different genres of games together. It's an indie game. I'm pretty sure this is would be considered an indie game. No, platformer. But no, but for the but I had to make a I had, there was a request for a hard and short platformer, so I mi mi mixed two platformers together. Glitch, random enemy die. I'm not sure how, but you're killing random enemies on the screen. I was moving in single direction and triggered something. Okay. This one's easier than the last one at the very least, insofar as I can actually do something. I just need to find the inve uh, the invention for DD, whatever that, whoever DD is, we don't know. What is that? Right. Maybe that's DD up there. Right. Glitch player to slow down. Okay, there's an H there. I missed the A, okay. Okay, if I just keep bouncing on it and not moving, else I seem to be able to survive. Okay, whatever. Okay, so we'll have eight more minutes to do this before we lose. Okay, there's an arrow saying to go... Oh, was that a checker point? Did we get a checker point? Okay, looks like uh, an NPC. Please find my invention. It means so much to me. Oh. Okay. You're useless then. Is that an extra? Hey, okay. I don't know what that is. Is that supposed to be like refill my health, but I have no health. It's one hit, it looks like. Random enemy die. Oh, cool. There's a platform right here. Okay. Ah. Okay. I have no idea where I'm going. I slow down yeah 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 can I jump back down here well, oh what did I just oh do I have ammo oh let me look at the controls see if I can um ground pound down plus a secondary weapon 
back, uh, dash, platformer, jump. Um, am I stuck here? I think I might be stuck here. Wait. Wait, how was I falling? There we go. I, it wasn't, that's really weird. That's very inconsistent falling down. Not a fan of that mechanic so far. But it might be a result of the stupid, like, two kinds of jumping my character has with the same button. Okay. Another checker point, maybe? Okay. Wait, was that the invention down there? See some, oh, that's no, that's the A. Okay, Ash. So far, it spells. Okay. Well, I have to give the invention back to DD2, it just says retrieve it. I don't even know where I am. Okay. Look at that. that. I guess I got all the letters. It's not the invention. Grab it. Oh, this one goes up here. I didn't see the. Okay. Let's go up there. Is that it? No. Oh, I forgot. I can wall jump. I like it. Okay. Come on. Go down. There we go. Hello, whoever just joined. I have no idea where I'm going. Maybe I have to go down here. PC doesn't work anymore. Hmm. Okay, let's jump up here. Where on earth could this thing be? Did I go everywhere down here to the left? There it is. Yep. Now I believe I have to go back to her now. Okay, I have three minutes to make it back. At least now I know where, where I'm going. Oh, that was scary, actually. I have to, that, that's, that's how I get across to her, isn't it? Right up there. do it why you found my adventure you're awesome we won mash complete collect rewards scout player player slow down glitch random enemy killed random enemy glitch tokens times 32 uh let's first save it 
And then let's get the code. So that's the code for this smash. Anyone wants to do it. Hey, return. So now that we have the thing saved, is that considered for the quest? For this kid. Game of the year, for real, Tomo, for real. Accept. Request complete. Collect rewards. Dragon, king of monsters, and 33 tokens. Okay. So, no request active, ZL, win three mashes. So now we just, let's see if there's anyone else in the store. Can we walk out of the store? That's actually a question. Hey, can you make a hybrid genre blend game that's normal? I only play normal games. Hybrid genre blend game. Okay. So I accepted it, right? Yeah, a really normal game. Whatever normal means. I guess that just might mean difficulty and length, etc. So what should we mix up this time? Let's go with stuff we haven't done yet. Let's do Metroidvania. I guess the only one we really haven't done yet then, I guess, is Stealth. No, maybe we did a stealth one. Like the really, really easy blue card one. Uh, Yeah, let's just do stealth. And let's change it to length, average, difficulty, normal. Because they want a hybrid that's really normal, normal, normal. So. I don't know if I have to beat it or not. But I'm going to assume I do. Play type game machine. Weeping mech fighter. Weeping mech fighter. Great name. Hey, loading. How have we been doing this this game for 50 minutes? This does not feel like it's been that long. I've shown off a few different mashes though. As memory slowly returned, Twile realized what he was. A failed hero. Aren't we all? Twile. Twill. He had let the prime evil win and was consumed. His soul stuck in the evil being's twisted realm. The shadow realm? But he knew that if he could just collect the missing time shard in under five minutes, he might build a path towards redemption. Okay. This is Metroidvania and... Whatever it's... And stealth. Twile. Whip. So, like, Castlevania. Super high jump. Okay. Something spawned. Ice. Those are our active glitches. So, I guess the one on the left is supposed to help us. The one on the right is a hindrance. The green one is good. The red one is bad. Okay. Something spawned nearby. What's going on? My guess that happened because I didn't attack for a few seconds. What? Something spawned. How do I use these things? I don't know. Whatever, let's just move on. So this is supposed to be a maze, Metroidvania, right? Oh my dead. Oh wait, I don't understand. Let's look at controls. Maybe I'm missing something. Metroidvania jump. Secondary weapon. Is that button? That didn't do anything. Dash didn't do anything. Attack. Alright, picked up bomb. Alright. Okay, now, now my whip works. Okay, so all those were things I can open with my whip. Okay, we're understanding this now a little bit more. For some reason, the like I was pressing the whip button, which is X. I was pressing it, I think. Okay. Glitch, ice, oh, I'm trapped. Whatever. 
whatever. You found a smoke grenade, so I need to find a time shard. Ouch. Oh, cool. You can actually duck and use the whip. What's this? Okay. Right. Now this is going to the stealth noise maker. This is going to the stealth genre. Is it all that's over here? Is this a place like okay? No, I can't walk over here. Hmm. Can I go up? No. Oh, yes, I can. Okay. Whatever. Ouch. Ouch. Wild moves so slowly. So is that all those it's just gonna keep spawning things with uh, to tokens in them? Alright, whatever. It looks like I can go this way. I guess not. So is that all that was over here? Okay. Hmm. Oh cool, the enemies respawned as soon as I came out the door. That's fair. Okay, is that the time shard? No, just, but I did pick up a prison key. Ouch! Twile is taking so much damage. Can it spawn me some health? That would be nice. Oh my god. Twile. Oh, ice. Ouch. Come on, I just keep taking damage. Come on, Twile, we need to go faster. Twile didn't move so slowly! I bet that's the timepiece. Looks like it's something the heavily guarded. Found Freeze Ray. Okay, now it's now the gun. Instead of just a whip. Okay. Okay. This is back in now I'm back in the first room. Okay, keep going this way. We only have 10 seconds left. I missed it, I guess. I didn't find the timepiece. Game over. Okay, let's let's retry that. Hmm. This is weird. I think I, I think I'm just bad at this game too. I think I'm just bad overall. That's what happens when you first play the game, though. You're gonna be bad at it, probably. Okay, so I can use the whip immediately. Good. Okay. 
Twile. Come on. Be a bros. Actually, do good things. Oh, what is that? Consumables. Oh, that's a health thing. Okay. Found the freeze ray again. Cause I did, because I already did, what's I, why is there a platform randomly inside the wall? So wait, do the spikes just instantly kill you? Looks like it. Okay. So pro tip, don't fall in the spikes. Spikes are bad. Okay. Was that? That obviously wasn't it. Let me change my freeze ray. Okay. Oh, cool. There are multiple of them now. Oh, hold on. Maybe that's uh, a thing. That hey, Oscar, I finally could come here. Welcome. Why is there? A yeah, it looks like there's a. What the heck? Did the platform here disappear? Cause look, I could stand on all this. I can stand on this, but I can't stand on this. This is so weird. Huh. Whatever. Twile, we're running out of time. We have to find this time shard, and I have no idea where it is. Alright. I want my whip back. Jump, you Twile! Yeah, I can't go in there. Ooh, two coins from this one. And I didn't find the bombs yet for that key. Okay. Stupid ice glitch. What? Smoke grenade. There we go. It's like, it wasn't collecting. Where did I find bombs? It was on this screen, right? The ice again! It spawns right in front of me, so it's not that I could have. I couldn't have avoided it. Ugh. There's bombs. Oh, yeah, I found it. Found the missing time shard. Mash complete. Wow, I'm bad at this game. Okay, we found a flamethrower, ninja stars, zebra enemy, and 63 tokens. So let's share it. Okay, that's our code. Play that one. And then, um, I should have hit, I should have saved it. Because now I don't know if, uh, it should work, right? For the quest. Okay, loading. If it did, then I'm gonna end the let's try. Because we've already been doing this for an hour. This is an interesting. No, actually, before I do that, I'll do one more random. I'll do a completely random mash. A quick one. Let's see. I'm on it. Oh, because I didn't save it. Um, no. I, I do have to do it again. Okay. I'm just gonna choose platformer, action adventure. Because I already completed the quest, but I didn't save it, so let's make sure we uh, get it right. Average and normal. So you have to save it for the quest. Then again, I could have just typed in, I could just type in the code, right? And then save it like that. Because you don't have to. Okay. 
I sh I don't know. Whoa, Dark World. All right, let's let's see what this game is. Loading, bunch of loading screens. Is it the same story as earlier? Science tells us that the first Koopa didn't have mouths or legs, but that despite this, touching them was still deadly to any player. <laughs> hey. Since then, there has been many evolutions of the Koopa, each with more teeth, bigger horns, or stronger legs to chase down and end would-be players. Oh, the wonders of science. So what's our goal? Scout again. Oh, he has terrible speed. But he has bombs. And dash and a double jump. Okay. Kill all enemies as the active glitch and move right. Smell, spell mash in under 10 minutes. What? Okay. I died twice in the first 20 seconds. Cause I don't, okay, but I, I forgot to double jump, so, okay. That thing will kill you. Glitch, move right. What? What activated that though? Was it taking damage? Well, we lost. I jumped right down into the pit because I was following the coins. Maybe if I just saved it, it would be good enough for her, right? <laughs> we'll try this again. So, so I guess we are not allowed to touch an enemy or else we're basically dead. How do I use bombs? Because I have them, but how do I actually use them? Not sure. Okay, we're just gonna take this slowly. We have 10 minutes to find these letters. What? I don't understand. It's just so confusing. Okay. Hey, okay, it made me smaller. Okay. The other one killed me because it was flashing, I guess. Ooh, a potion. It'll restore some health. Theoretically. Okay, right, now I'm big boy. Okay. You found a frost ball. Okay, that activated the glitch. Yeah, we don't like that. Okay. I'm so confused. Okay, there's the M. Okay, that one will kill me. Ah! You can't even stand on it? Oh, and I'm all the way back here. 
beautiful. I thought you were at least allowed to stand on them, not just activate them. No, you're not allowed to do anything. I don't know what I can trust in this. All I know is not that. I can trust those. Okay. I don't know what that is. Kuba Toss. But using that kind of stuff will just activate the move right glitch, which is, you know, really bad for something like this when you just, there's literally no land to walk on. Okay. Found a fireball. Oh, yeah, and all this seems to be unusable to me. Where's another letter? I haven't found one in a while. Why is that glitching out? I guess it's a glitch, right? Well, that's the end of the stage, and we missed two letters. How? ground pound okay that's only what they um that's your secondary weapon yeah I don't I don't see where the other letters could have been Okay, whatever. Let's just... No, I can't save it. You can only share it. You can't save until you beat it. So I do have to beat a mixed genre, all normal thing, and then save it. And if you don't save it, your quest doesn't get finished, I guess. Okay, right, we're trying that again. Um, let's choose JRPG and shoot him up. Yes. <laughs> no problem. Hey. Let's hope we can beat this one. <laughs> Brave intern. Okay, loading. Load already! Chapter 10, Grimlight Massacre. All that stood between our party and annihilation was a mage of the dark. His name was Valtarian Malik, or Malik, and his mastery of fire and ice drove off the attackers. The entire town of Grimlight lay in smoldering ruin. Glorio had pushed the attack from both sides, and the defenders never had a chance. Bypassing the fortress of Memoria, the attackers now drove to East Dorp, where they could crush Malik in one final battle. Before we could escape, we had to gather a pile of cat big enough to sit upon. But with the introduction of, Ma of Malik, our party now felt complete, and soon we would make House Glorio regret their invasion. I don't care about any of this. <laughs> Fluff. Okay, April. Health? Okay, two health, one speed. Why well, I always get horrible speed? I have a Blade of the Heavens. 
And do I have and no special abilities? Okay, active glitch, currency up, active glitch, enemy spawned. Gather a pile of cat big enough to sit upon. Okay. I have no time limit, which is. Ah! Okay. Why is this player speed boosted? Level up. This is interesting, actually. But I'm already half dead. You found 86 cat. Hey, item, small potion, weapon, empty, armor, empty, party, April, cat, 112. So how much cat do I need? Level up. Primary weapon power boosted, but I died. I'm gonna share this one. We're gonna retry that. <laughs> I'm, I'm barely. I'm just bad at this at this whole game. Oh dear. Loading. Right. We're trying it again. So, okay, I need 200 cats. That's what it looked like. Random battle? Okay. Blade of the Heavens, good. So I already have four cats. Another Blade of the Heavens. Level up, player speed boosted. Found 79 cat. Okay, so I'm already almost halfway there. So ignore the stuff in the open because I don't know what that those entail. Another random battle. Blade of the Heavens. Level up. Primary weapon has boosted power. Good. Looks like I also get a cat for every enemy I destroy. Nine, okay, we only need nine more, then we win, it looks like. A. This is weird. Ah! I can't kill those things, can I? Whatever, let's, let's leave. I'll just try to find another random battle, I guess. Okay. I can walk over the trees, it's nice. Okay, hey, random battle. Let's go. We just need nine more cat. Level up. More. Win. We did it. Mash complete. Collect rewards. 
a deliberate Taz, JRPG Overworld Theme 2, A4 Moth, A55 Thunder Killer. Okay, so we want to first save, and then we already have the code, right? But I'm just re-showing it again. Return. So now that it's saved, we should be able to turn it in for the quest. Because we beat it and saved it. But if you forget to save, that's kind of dumb. Yeah, there you go. Request complete. And we get Helmet Crab and 10 tokens. Okay. So, I said I was going to do a quick mash, but I'm going to end. I'm actually going to end uh, the Let's Try here, so let's pause the timer. I'm not ending the stream, but I am ending the recording. Thank you all for watching. Hope you all have a nice time. I'm Shot 600 I'll see you guys next time. Subscribe to me here on YouTube and follow me on Twitch. Same name there. there it's the same name there, Joshua 600 Yeah, for example, with this game, if you just like type in the chat, hey, mix these two genres with these settings, I can do it. Sounds cool, right? Request live? Yeah. Okay. Goodbye.